Hey there guys, welcome back to more Catherine Full Body Edition. So in the last one, I was going around the bar and talking to these people and getting drunk. So now I think it's about time to leave because I'm pretty sure I've talked to everybody. But hold on, wait, can I talk to the boss? Well, let me chat up with this guy first. Time will slowly pass each time you sit and talk to people. Yeah, I already learned that from the last one. Over time, the people and the conversation topics will change. Some customers are experiencing difficulties. Try to cheer them up when you can. Okay, I can do that. You can go home at any time from the door in the front. Perhaps it wasn't the best idea to hire a musician for her looks. It's just that when I saw her, I felt an arrow pierce my heart. That's a miracle you haven't run this place into the ground. <clears throat> anyway, have you seen the news recently? It's nothing but stories about those deaths. They said that there are several people who've died in the same fashion. Erica says that people believe it's a curse given when a woman is scorned by an unfaithful man. A grown man talking about curses? Yeah, just ignore Erica. A woman's guess is much more accurate than a man's certainty. To pitch a phrase from a certain someone. You don't think it applies to Erica? Then there's nothing to worry about. Erica's guesses are never on target. By the way, you look a bit glum. Hey boss, you uh, you ever cheated on someone? My, my, my. It's not like that. It, it was an unintentional event. Unintentional? Are you sure about that? I'm telling the truth, I actually don't remember. Well, from what we've seen in the cutscenes, I believe that he doesn't remember because we haven't seen much. To tell you the truth, I can't really remember. Did you have too much to drink? Oh my. Besides, I heard you were wearing those shades to hide from an ex-girlfriend. To a man, it may be a one-night stand, but to a woman, it is the beginning of a lifetime. To borrow a line from a certain someone. Anyway. It is a strange rumor. Both of us should be careful. Alright, I can see that time has passed. So, I didn't want to interrupt them, but I see that on my left with a sweater, and on my right with the with the hair, the black hair guy, um, they're both, they both were in the nightmare. I met them both. So it's kind of cool to see they actually meet people here that you met in the nightmare as well. Um, let's, uh, talk some more. That pianist seems to have a rather unique style. Well, I welcome the change of pace. This customer is a journalist. He seems to be obsessing over a certain legend lately. A legend? I was originally looking into these suspicious deaths that have been happening lately. I'm Justin, by the way. Hmm. Have I met you somewhere before? Maybe. Sure, I've seen you before. Oh, sorry. We were talking about the legend. Anyway, in my research, I found records indicating that similar cases occurred in hundred year cycles. Many men died last time as well. It's the truth. Wow. Every hundred years, huh? I found a strange variation on this legend going around too. Hmm? There's a man who survives it. Survives the dreams? Very, very rarely. There's a man who is cursed but doesn't die. Isn't that interesting? It's said that the survivor is granted one wish. If he wished for eternal youth, he might still be around. <laughs> it's like a magic lamp. Well, if this is what you're coming up with, you have a wish in mind for yourself? Hmm, to live forever? Not too typical? Me? I'd wish for something different. Like what? I may wish to change the past. And make someone kill me. Oh, uh, <laughs> I wonder what I'd wish for. You got a mail. Oh, is that from that certain someone? Did we get an image? It's not that I'm waiting for it, it's just that, you know, it's been a while. <laughs> Thanks for writing back. Be sure to save my address, okay? I'm going to the bar again tonight, so stick around till I get there. Even if it gets late. Here's a reward I promise. Don't show it to anyone else. Um. <laughs> 
You see that? Press triangle for image. Should I do it? Well, since I've been waiting this long, might as well. Shit! Can't look at this in public. I need to check this out somewhere where no one can see. Okay, now I can check it. Clearly, nobody can come in here. Holy shit! Dear Vincent, on your... That's my... That's my right, but that's her left... Her left bosom. <clears throat> nice. <laughs> yeah, I wonder if the woman's wrath or I heard about from Erica is real. She said that I was going to die somewhere along the line. Apparently, I have a wanting look to my eyes. Would I be cursed for unfaithfulness for this, too? Whatever. Still, she really rags on you, huh? Woman's dearest delight is to wound man's self-conceit. Uh, to wrangle the words of a certain someone. But tell me, do I look vain or otherwise untoward? I don't know, but in Erica's case, it's a bit different. I cannot deny that I look upon Rin with a certain male gaze. Regardless, let's both try to avoid any curses and deaths, shall we? Uh, I think I'll go home for today. My head hurts. Oh no, I want to talk to him some more. Man, if I only knew if he was going to leave so early, I would have said something. Hey, Justin, while I have you, let's talk. You played that Rapunzel game over there? Some stages are supposed to be impossible, but they're a cinch if you've got technique. I think I'm pretty good at coming up with techniques. I'm gonna head home. Excuse me. Glad I caught you. Good night. Have sweet dreams. I love you. Quite a few customers come here just to see Erica, which is great for business. And now we have Bree. Hmm. I guess you can have too much of a good thing. Uh, it's late. Anyway, I can't hurt her anymore. Hey. Hey, Vincent. We're all heading home. How about you? Uh, well, I think I'll stay and drink a little more. <sighs> How long are you going to avoid the inevitable? You'll have to pay for your sins. Did I, did I just hear something? Hey, come here. Wait, that voice. Hmm? You know what? I didn't mean to stay for that long. Uh, clearly Rin is trying to sleep, so I don't want to talk to her. Uh, Erica, you're a nice gal. Let's, um, let's chat up some storms. Yeah. Oh, the one on her left wrist. Yeah, I hear strange noises coming from it sometimes, almost like it's talking. Maybe it's some newfangled radio. Oh, I'm so curious. I can't even focus on work. Oh, what else is new? I mean, aren't you two like buddies now? Why couldn't you just ask her like, hey, that bracelet looks kind of cool. Can I see it? Can I wear it? Can I see why it's talking to you? Hey, Rin, why is it talking to you? Yeah, but you didn't answer my question. I asked, why is it talking to you? You'd better straighten things out soon. You guys are still just kids. Only your bodies grew up. <laughs> She's talking about my pee pee. Well, I'm all done here. At this point, is it even worth it? Is it is she worth my time? You're not Catherine. I want Catherine. Hey, are you going home? Yeah, I have stuff to do. Like go my nightmares. I have something to do. Uh, oh. Well, I'm glad I got to see you tonight. 
Be careful on your way home. It's just, my mother's been calling me up and asking how we're doing. Well, you don't want to marry your girlfriend? I don't just sleep around. Uh, Vincent? What did you think of my performance? Chamber where traitors are put to rest. Oh. I'm sensing an unusual presence tonight. What could be waiting for you? Stage three, torture chamber, first floor. The main course of the deadly climb begins here. The main course of a deadly climb. Track blocks activate when you step on them. Don't stop on top of them. A trap lock. Okay. Gotta watch out for that. Oh, damn it. Again? How long is this gonna go on? It's been every night now. Oh, go sideways this time. Okay, so once it activate, can't reactivate. Gotcha. That clearly touched me, but it didn't count, so I'm okay with that. Do you think it's because of my drunkness? Did my drunkness make me go faster? I want to say no, but I'll just say yes, just in case. What's this? By using a Bible? Okay. Oh, the Bible murders them. Okay. I thought I would just push them somewhere safety. Oh, that's what it looks like when it gets you. Um, can you go down here? Um, uh, okay, got that. Uh, let's go over here. Climb, climb, cl push. Climb, climb, climb. Uh, let's see here. All right, gotta go fast. Climb, 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 climb! Rip. Oh, whoops. Did not mean to do that. Oh, too bad I can't switch back. I saved you, pal. That might as well. Oh, it didn't work. What? I can't pull it. I can't move that either. Oh, because he's in a way. Move. Jeez, man. Uh, push that? Oh, that might have been a bad idea, actually. There we go. Jump. Jump, jump. All right, cool, I did it. I made it. Oh, whoops, I wasn't looking. Grab it.
to be honest, I've done pretty bad when I first started playing, and um, I haven't edited that part yet, the first part, and so I'm going to have to take away a lot of my mistakes, even though I do show some of it. I plan to show some of my mistakes. Um, so basically, I'm just doing a little better, is what I'm trying to say. And I feel proud. You're not a sheep either. What's going on? There's no time for that. This place is bad. If you don't get out of here, you're gonna die. Die? I see. So that's why everyone's so scared. In that case... I'm telling you, this is no time for piano! Playing music calms my heart, even in a place like this. I'd like to share that feeling with everyone else. Was that because of Rin's playing? Rin? Can I interact with the piano? Look, piano. What's going on? Really interesting that Rin was able to be here for a bit and how she didn't see me as a sheep um like i mentioned before i did watch a i did watch some gameplay of this game years ago from another youtuber and um yeah the whole rin dynamic pretty much changes the way i look at the game because originally of course she wasn't in the game so now that they added her um it just adds some really cool dialogue and extra stuff like that uh let's just save right now Hey, you guys okay? So, he calls them the sheep with the... The regent hair? Regent hair? Hello. And you're the glasses. Hey, hello. Hey. I feel like I've seen that pianist before. I can't remember where. Whatever. I'll let you in on a technique I figured out. Lay it on me. Yeah, let's do it. Allow me to explain the spider. If there is a block in your way, Try dangling off the edge and moving around it. If there's a block in your way, try dangling off the edge and move around it. Alright, it's kind of like a basic move. It's a useful way to go around a block to find another place to stand. By moving around, you can skip having to move blocks. I'm pretty sure I did that one time. You mustn't let your guard down. I wonder if my girl's the witch. Oh, you mean the one from the rumors? She got all worked up all of a sudden for no reason the other day. She was just stabbing her dinner with her fork, man. I thought she was gonna reach over and cut me. Maybe you just like those kind of women. Men who want to control women tend to have a desire to be controlled by women. It's the truth. Hello. Hey. Wanna talk about techniques? Yes, please tell me. Yeah, let's do it. Allow me to explain the spider. Oh, it repeats this technique? Well, it was pink, so I assumed that'd be something different. If there's a block in your way, yeah, we learned that just now. By moving around, you mustn't let your guard down. All right, now it's gray. Hello. What happened to the piano music? Provided a nice ambience for discussion, developing techniques. It'd be nice if you could join us. Who me? Your climbing was quite innovative. It's the truth. I mean, I wouldn't say innovative. Just, I'm just trying to survive. Here's a technique I thought of. Allow me to explain the bridge. If you must cross a gap, 
Move a block over it to create a bridge. That way, you can reach the other side of the gap. What do you think? Did you know that one already? Oh, what about this thing? Allow me to explain the flying bridge. Oh, I made a technique? A flying bridge. Oh, so the other side can catch it with their edge? Using principles of the bridge, gaps two blocks wide are no problem. Push the same block twice to push it to the other side. Then add another block next to it to complete the bridge. You know, this whole edge system is pretty interesting for this type of game in the puzzle style. I really like it. Wow, I knew it. You're not just a regular guy. That's really cool, buddy. I think that'll help me beat the next area. You're welcome. Hello. Do you want to review the techniques? I'm in a hurry. I gotta go. Good luck to you guys. <sighs> hey, you you have a tie. Wait. I saw you next to the regent hair guy, right? I think I did. Are you paying attention in the confessional? There's someone in the real world who wants me dead. Yeah, I heard. You think of anyone who would do that? Yeah, I can. A lot of them. A lot? But this curse is nothing compared to there. I escaped from hell. Alright, good for you. Tonight's product is... Who are you? Sheep with sunglasses. Just get me out of here. I'm close too, pal. I don't know where the hell I am either. How dare you talk to me like that? You're a sheep. I'm the heir to a big corporation. I'm a VIP. Why am I even bothering talking to a sheep? Stand up and stop complaining. All we can do is keep climbing. Shut up! I know. Maybe for a couple thousand, I'll give you some techniques, but other than that, man, I. Don't know what to tell you. What are you selling? If you want an item, only have some coins. Tonight's product is the bell turns all nearby blocks into basic white blocks. The bite eliminates nearby enemies. All right, so it's giving me choices, right? The bell for eight thousand, the Bible for three thousand. Oh, uh. Bell turns all nearby blocks into basic white block. Ah, uh, just in case. That'd be nice to have just in case. All right, so <laughs> a smart choice. Thank you, kind sheep. Uh, let's already save. Uh, let's already save. Uh, le well, well, this is a surprise. I didn't expect to have a visitor. This must be the first time such a thing has happened here. What the hell is going on? You know something about Ren, don't you? Let's just say the tide has shifted. Thanks to you, something unexpected is taking place. Regardless, I'll continue to ask you questions. This is the third question. Do you easily fall for people who come on to you? Ah. <laughs> uh, embarrassingly? Yeah. memories with you when you return to the real world so I'm gonna forget this place when I wake up if you were to try anything in reality it'd be troublesome for my game that's the rule no exceptions Oh wow, it's about almost 50-50. I would say that's about maybe... What's the pink? Yeah. The pink looks like about 48... Yeah, 48, 47? Around that percentage? I would say. Let's see here. For men only. Really? Okay. Women only. Hold on, that looks about the same. I can see that for the blue, men has a bit more. Just a tiny bit more. Or no, that's the women. The women has a bit more blue. 
This is really cool. I like this. It's really interesting. Um, I'd say this is more interesting than knowing the world stats for those Telltale games. Because a lot of those, they're like multiple choices, but this is just two choices. So you can see the bigger difference. But the only part I don't understand is the survey results from people in their 20s and 30s. I want to say that's just there for a guess or something, because I don't know how they can track ages. That's the part I don't understand. Remember, each type of block follows its own set of rules. Uh, each type of block follows its own set of rules. Uh, yeah, I kind of figured that out. Pay close attention to the behavior of each one if you wish to survive. Oh, damn it! Those traps again! Commencing area two. Are you ready? Yes, I am. Vincent! Who? Rin, where are you? Up here! The ground below is falling! Please be careful! Wait, Rin is here climbing too? Are you serious? Give me a break! Wait a minute. Isn't this nightmare only for men? Does that make rent? Wait a minute. Oh no. Oh, I just figured something now. From here on out, Rin will use a special power to support. Her. Oh, so she's not climbing. She's just talking to me. Okay, well that makes more sense. I was thinking the other thing. Never mind then. When Rin starts to play the piano, the rate at which blocks fall will slow down. Oh, that's cool. Take advantage of the situation and climb quickly toward the goal. So does the playing piano part does automatically? I don't activate that myself. <laughs> he just fell. Ah, <laughs> oh, loser. Alright, look up. Up, down. Okay, uh... Let's jump around here. Activate it. Activate it. Um... Pull that, climb, climb, climb. I thought that was a trap for a second there. Hey pal, move! Alright, now that's gonna be a problem. Push? Push? There we go. Checkpoint. I did the spider. You saw that? I thought that squashed me for a sec there. I was gonna get squashed. Um, I can do the bridge. Oh, wait a minute. That does not work at all. That doesn't work either. Oh, well, hold on. There we go. Wait a second. No, push it. Uh, push this. Oh no, wait. Pull this. 
Pull this. Push it. Thank you, Rin. You're so nice. You know that ability I had I was carrying on? Yeah, that could have been helpful a couple times maybe, but I just still don't understand how that works. So it makes a 3x3 three three around me? Or a 3x3 three three up and down? How does that work? Listen, we're kind of in the middle of something. Shut up! You're not the only one whose life is at stake here. That piano saved me earlier. Don't worry, I won't stop playing it. Sorry, I guess we'll have to talk later. Yeah, this isn't really the time, huh? But I'm so happy. I didn't think I'd ever be able to repay you. I hope I can help you somehow. You do, by slowing down the blocks from falling. Thank you. I get it. Listening to that girl play the piano does make it a bit more bearable. She's, uh, quite a unique performer. I wonder why she's the only one who looks human. Maybe someone called for her. A little eye candy for these trying times. Oh. So, no techniques? Do you know this way to climb? I get the feeling something big's coming up. Want to trade techniques? Sure. Sure. Allow me to start with the technique I developed. Allow me to explain the swing out. When you pull a block, drop in hand, then move to the other side. Now you can push the block. I feel like this is very similar with another technique, unless this is like combining two techniques. I think it is. It's combining the bridge technique sort of here with the spider technique where you go around the blocks. It's useful in tight spaces. Remember this one. Not a bad trick, you think? I have more. Allow me to explain the toppler. The toppler? If a stack of blocks is full of holes, pushing the lower blocks is an option. Wait, what do you mean pushing? By causing blocks to fall, you may find a path upwards. Oh, I see now. So you make all the chunks fall down, and then you'll you'll have a new set of blocks to work with. Okay, I'll think of that one. That I'll try it out. Oh, I just thought of something like that. Maybe this will help. Allow me to explain wall suspension. By using edges, you can connect with blocks forming walls. Blocks make edge connections on all sides, not just left and right. Suspend them from the walls and make new footing. I see. I didn't think of that. Buddy, you got moves. If I was a chick, I'd be all over you. So the one that I taught them was the reverse version where I don't push them out. I push blocks together so the, the blocks in the background will stay on the foreground. Oh, is that golden guy again? The rich Saudi Arabian. All right, see here. Um, save here. What is true? Have you heard the rumor about true freedom? They say that true freedom awaits you at the top. What is true freedom? Does that mean that even I can be free too? Free from the life I live? You're only going to find out if you reach the top. Can you stand? Don't be nice to me. I may push you off one of these days. Well, if I have a Bible, I will kill you off one day. Uh, she was Scarf. Are you new? <sighs> so tired of this shit. This won't go home. Feeling down, buddy? Why don't you let loose and sing your heart out? <laughs> hey, why 
How do you know that song? I heard this song a long time ago. We don't remember the lyrics. Do you? <laughs> Come on, can't you sing any better? You're completely off pitch. I couldn't even tell what song you were singing. Am I really that bad? No one's ever told me that before. Hmm. <laughs> so you know a lot about music? No. I'm just a cook. You're just a cook? Try singing it again. I know one thing, you're not cut out for singing. Hey! Hey! Think they'd mind if I set up a helipad here? Just in case I need a lift. What are you talking about? That's why you're such a fat ass. <gasps> I'm gonna turn your pudgy ass into mutton stew. Hey, that's harsh, man. Ah! Ha 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 ha! Ah! I see. I see. I had no idea that's how people saw me. Y you can keep insulting me if you'd like. Ah, uh, that's creepy, man. I love how real that is, how rich people never understand, like, how normal people talk or think perspective-wise. It's really funny. Anyone else I can talk to? Get it now. Um, I already saved, so let's just go in the booth. That piano seems to have an interesting power, but will it always be there for you? What do you mean by that? It's your destiny, so do your best. This is the fourth question for a new possibility. Would you want your partner to disclose all their secrets? <laughs> Um, yes, nothing too big. I am in the belief where if it's like no biggie secret, like, oh my God, my friend told me this, that she cheated on her boyfriend, that kind of secret, then, you know, no, I, I really don't mind, you know, learning that. But if it's like a family secret, something that she's really not supposed to say no matter what, then I'm not going to bother her. It's fine. It's fine. You know? I'm not I'm not gonna I'm not gonna push her. And that's your opinion. I hope you are being honest. You'll need to survive if you want to learn the truth. There are sheep that have persevered in the past. Really? All the way up on the eighth floor is a cathedral. It's said that those who reach that holy pinnacle will have the path of freedom opened unto them. How you proceed from there will be up to you. Listen, I can hear the voice of the one trying to take your life tonight. Again? I'm actually a little curious to see what's the stats on that one. I can imagine it's like more on the side that I chose a little bit. Yes, nothing too big. Oh, wow, really? Oh, that's a lot of yeses. Wow, people really want to be that nosy, huh? Men only. Okay. Wow, surprisingly. Women only. Wow, okay, surprisingly. Actually, no, you know you know what? Women are a little nosy. I'm not going to lie. They're a little nosy, so it makes kind of sense. I'm sorry if you're a woman. I'm not talking about you. I'm talking about the majority of women that are nosy. If you're not nosy, that's fine. I'm not talking to you personally. Don't take it too personal. All right, we're on the third floor. Tonight's deaths, one thousand. Final area for tonight. Use the terrain to your advantage and avoid attacks. Avoid attacks. Is there another boss? Come on, man! Is it this time? A what? What is that? The killer. Do not die. All right, I got it. All right, I got it. Wait, what's that? When you use an energy drink, you can jump two blocks up. No way. This allows you to move forward when you find yourself unable to climb normally. Okay, that is a very special that I am not going to use just, you know, 
randomly. I'm gonna have to save that. I'm trying new strategy. Alright, I got it. Alright, I got it. Do all of them just in case. What was that? Oh, that got me. Whatever that was. Please don't get near me, whatever you are, you butt thing. Checkpoint. Undo. Hold on, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Uh, um, 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 hold on, hold on. Drink. Pull. Almost there. Come on. I can make it. Rin, a little help, please. A little push. No! Oh, oh god damn it. Screw you, butt. I get it now. Opening the door. survived another night why don't we take another peek into the past tonight's theme is the fleeting memories of youth come on don't leave so soon i'm just filling in for someone while they're gone filling in damn i'm gonna make you my own personal cheerleader <laughs> don't you have a girlfriend I heard a college student asked her out yesterday. Don't doubt that. I huh? have to go change. Uh, Sorry. Uh. <laughs> hey, guys! I brought lunch again today! All right! Yes! <laughs> She's totally into me, man. No. Ah, uh, come on. I can dream, can't he? You adored her so much back then. Shame how people change. On the other hand, maybe you can change again now. Where will you go from here? This is getting exciting. <sighs> Catherine? Huh? Catherine? 
doing here? I thought I came home alone. Oh, shit. Uh, sorry. D did, did I say something? Catherine. I did? Uh, <laughs> well, uh... It's okay. <laughs> but it's a bit embarrassing. It is? You haven't called me by my name before, <laughs> have you? Y your name? <laughs> what is it, Vincent? <laughs> uh, nothing. Are you fucking kidding me? Hey, are you angry with me? Sorry for coming by out of the blue. Wait, so she just crashed here? Well, I'm more surprised than angry. I just... I thought that you'd want to see me, Vincent. I... <laughs> Whoa, kidding. hey, hey. <laughs> I couldn't keep myself away from you. <laughs> Last night was amazing. It was the first time I've ever done... something like that. What? What? Whoa, whoa, wait. What did I do? You're gonna make me say it? <laughs> You're whoa, so whoa, 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 wait. Okay, time out. Time out. <laughs> You've got ten seconds. Okay, look. Why me? Hmm? <laughs> because I like you. What about you, Vincent? What do you think about me? I, uh... I think you're really cute. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> what else? What else? Am I just cute? How do I put this? I'm kind of jealous of you. You seem to live however you want. <laughs> what do you mean? That's normal, isn't it? Vincent, you can live however you want, too. Just so long as you never think of cheating on me. <laughs> cheating? <laughs> uh, listen, Catherine. There's something I gotta tell you. Come on. Hey. You think you look good in those? <laughs> yes. <sighs> Quit joking around and listen. This is really important. Okay, sorry. This month, I'm running really late. Huh? I think I'm pregnant. <laughs> Say something. Ah, sorry, uh... So, what are you thinking? So why am I sweating? I mean, I, I have to take responsibility, right? Uh, 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 Come on, say something. Uh, uh, of course, I'm, I'm happy, but... But? This is great. So you're happy. That's good to hear. <laughs> to be honest, I was a little worried. It's so hard to tell what you're thinking sometimes. Oh, don't worry about me. I mean, yeah, it's surprising, but it's not like you're sure of anything yet, right? Well, yeah. Ah. Huh? Go ahead, answer it. Uh, okay. Hello? Oh, hello. It's me. Uh, hello. Thank you for calling. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> hey, I'm in the area. You think we can meet up? Yeah, that's going to be a little difficult. Uh... Where are you right now? How did she get 
need my number. I gotta hang up or she'll suspect something. Uh, what's that? Hello? Uh, you're, you're breaking up. Huh. What was that? Huh. <clears throat> huh? Uh, just a call from work. Said something about a bug, but it got cut off. You know, the reception isn't very good in the office, but it didn't sound urgent, so... Not that. Your phone. Did you get another one? Huh? Oh, this! Yeah, the, the new model came out last week, so... It hasn't been that long since you got your old one. You could have still used it. Didn't you buy a new computer a little while ago, too? You always throw your money away. I... You're going to have to watch yourself from now on. You know what I mean, right? Right. Sorry. Well, it's okay since you've been working hard. After all, I might have to take maternity leave. Yeah, you might, huh? Oh, but I plan to go back to work after having the baby. We'll just have to split up the housework, okay? You can't throw your clothes everywhere anymore. Oh, okay. Also, it's a woman's job to date day day another woman. Possible. That's terrible. It's a man's job. Whoa, it's a man's job. It really okay. ticks me off. How can I curse him to death? Maybe his name is Waiter. Oh. Waiter. Oh. Waiter. So you need to make sure you're saving up. And all your late night drinking isn't cheap, you know. So I'll be handling all our bank accounts. I'm gonna go to the bathroom. Vincent, you've been acting weird today. No, 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 no. I'm fine. I'm fine, really. No, I don't mind being in the smoking section. Uh, hey. Is this the smoking section? Huh? Well, yeah. Oh, right. You've got to quit smoking, too. It's not good for the child. Bathroom, gotta go right now. I'll ask my parents when they'll be available. Uh, that was a fucking close one. Hmm? Rin! You in there? You left your door open. Okay, uh, I can explain this. It's, uh, it's not what you think. I'm not that kind of guy. I mean, I, I don't even know what happened. You don't remember? Well, you know, I've <laughs> been kind of forgetful lately. And, uh, <clears throat> anyway, can we talk about this room? Is something wrong with it? Not wrong. I just mean, what is all this? Like, like that thing. What is, what is that thing? Oh, that? At nighttime, all those lights turn on. It's really pretty. Oh, and that one wiggles when you sing to it. It makes me feel better when I'm down. Well, I mean, I guess that's what the piano is for, right? Sometimes I don't even have the energy for that. These things make me happy just by looking. They're my treasures. You don't say. Well, come to think of it, I used to collect those 
ninja sheep erasers I got in my cereal? Oh, they might not have looked like much. But I sure did love the damn things. Parents didn't, though. One day they just threw them all in the trash. That's... that's so sad. Only you should get to say what's important to you. I know. I'll give you one of mine. The tip lights up on that one. No, it's fine. But thanks for the offer, though. Are you sure? I want to share my happiness with you. <laughs> You're an odd one, Rin. And yet, it's kind of a breath of fresh air. I've never met anyone quite like you before. <laughs> so, what kind of people have you known? Oh, well, you know, people telling me to be a man, to grow up. Just a lot of people trying to push their values onto me, you know? I think they're the odd ones. No one can tell you how to live your life, Vincent. Yeah. Oh, right. Uh, here, you'll need a way to stay in touch with Erica, right? Well, there's my old cell phone. You know how to use it? Here, let me show you. Uh, okay, you see this? You press this button here, and then you... All right, you got it all set up. Why don't you, uh, why don't you try sending me a text? Oh, look, there you it is. Got a mail. Hmm. Ka 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 Catherine? I'm not sure about the spelling, but, um, that's the name I remember. Wait, when she, she told, told me her name, did I only hear the last part? <laughs> oh, I see. So you're another one. <laughs> okay. Is something wrong? No, no. But uh, Rin is easier to say, so can I keep calling you that? <laughs> of course. Huh. Okay. At the cafe? <laughs> That's a close call. <laughs> I can't believe she didn't catch you. Dude, is she really pregnant? If she is, your life is fucked with a capital F. It's not fucked yet. I, I mean, nothing's set in stone. So then, what'd you tell her? <laughs> Who's the father? <laughs> I told her I was happy to hear about it. it doesn't look like you're happy at all. <sighs> this is all getting too much for me, you know? So you're finally tying the knot. Congrats, Papa. Get ready to kiss your wife's ass for the rest of your natural life. No going out late, no liquor, no smoking, no gambling. No relaxing on weekends because you've got to take care of the kids. Really? Dang, that sounds really tiring. Hey, you guys. Quit filling his head with doom and gloom. Erica! Come on, cheer up. Raising a nice, happy family is supposed to be a good thing, right? <laughs> a happy family. Never had one of those before. I can't see it. Yeah, well, you're not the only one. That's irrelevant. It's just because of the way you two grew up. So, Vincent, what's this weird dream you said you had? We'll listen to you tonight. Weird dream? Why are you asking now? I, mean, I really can't remember it anyway. You don't? I was being chased by something. Uh, I don't know, it was scary. Uh, sounds common to me. Hey, excuse me. Yeah, and you feel like you didn't get any sleep at all that night, right? Excuse me. Oh, what are you doing here? Did you people know the reason you're taught as a child to count sheep so you'll fall asleep yeah, is... Yeah, yeah, sheep rhymes with sleep or something. Ah, uh, sorry. Hey, boss, another rum and cola, please? Hey, don't be so rough on the guy. One day we'll all be old farts like him. Not all of us. Anyway, you're having these weird dreams because you're cheating. Yeah, I get that, but... Besides, Catherine might be pregnant, right? <sighs> Don't need to remind me of that. 
It is in a man's basest instincts to cheat. Here you go. Enjoy. Yeah, set it down and walk away. It's about what happens now. Well, have fun while you still can. Those two used to date each other. Feather and Beetlejuice? What? No way! Well, same-sex couples are pretty common these days. That's not what I mean! When two chicks pair up, that's two less fish in the sea for me! Aw, <sighs> oh, were you seriously thinking of dating him? Just say it. <sighs> What do you think about same-sex couples? Did you really need to call her over for that? Um, is it a big deal? I guess I never thought about it that much. Hmm. As long as you love each other, that's all that matters, isn't it? So they don't even need to be human? Yeah. <sighs> this girl's on a whole nother level. I don't know. I think it's sweet, isn't it, Toby? Uh, I told you, I like girls. You too, right, Vincent? Huh? I mean, yeah. Well, you are dating one. Or two. Shut up. Oh, what am I gonna do with you guys? Oh, I got a text. Got mail. You got mail. Is it congratulations? It's congratulations. Fantastic news. You have successfully completed stage three, the torture chamber. Go to the ward self a menu, check your challenge. Your best score to stage three. All right, thank you. Don't really care. <clears throat> um, right, so this was a really good video. I'll go around and talk to people and next part so yeah look out for that if you are if you don't care then look out for that and i will see you in the next one so look out for that bye